So this is turning into the how many days in a row can I make a vlog about Williamsburg while making a different each day up for the challenge. We need to get some pizza. Tired of Chinese, not really, but just for today and it's fast and it's quick and look at those cool light patterns. It's caused by the grease right on my lens. So let's go get some of the best pizza at best pizza. I am very picky with my eating and it's because I have high standards. And if you don't understand that, we're probably not gonna get along. It doesn't have to be expensive. It doesn't have to be fancy. The food just has to be good. There's so many expensive restaurants where the food is garbage because you're paying for the rent, you're paying for the ambiance. It all starts with the food. And the only places I eat at just have simply good food, whether they're cheap or expensive. It's the place that I'm coming from, always. All right, pizza done. Guess what's next? Coffee time, actually tea time. See, it's the consistency. It's, it's the consistency of eating well. It's the consistency of vlogging every day. It's the consistency of hustling into different corners. And it's that consistent. I even wear the same clothes every day during the winter time, typically. And it's just, it's 100% consistency. That just gets me to where I need to be. I haven't walked down this side street in a while and just look how spooky it is. I was there the day he painted that and I think there's a picture on my Instagram. It's about two years ago. <laughs> Buddy's DJing. That was what that nightclub was. And I didn't bring my tripod, so it really gives me those steady shots. But the goal is to make a nice little time lapse without the tripod, just rest the phone. Watch what's on the other side of this. cannot make do with what he finds in his natural surroundings, then this man better off find something else to do. Just loving those vibes, those good old DJ vibes. Some old time buddies of mine and uh, good chill and loving that. I'm gonna go check out this other spot. It's very late and really I'm, I'm waiting for the Uber prices to come down and uh, let's go see what's up. All right, I had to stop and I mean, look at this right here. Beautiful thing. Look, look, look at that. The seats are nicely preserved. I would love, I would love to just shoot a video with that in it. And uh, these are the things that inspire you. I could walk all the way to Manhattan, but I won't. Fun level tonight, medium. I don't know, Tuesday night, just medium fun level. I mean, there's more fun when there's more people. I just can't wait till there's a lot more people. Ooh, that's cool. Uh, I like that, I like that. So it's about 3 a.m. and the Uber prices refused to go down. They stayed around $9. And usually at this time of night, I can get a $4 Uber ride home. It's not the case tonight, so bus it is. Plus you get the added benefit of the fantastic view. <laughs> that I ran into Osama like that randomly. And now that I've chosen to take a train to get the added benefit of cool sights.
this is what all the effort was for. Inspiring AF. <laughs> That's a wrap. I'm gonna go pick up some ingredients, cook that same pasta that I did a few days ago, edit, and then uh, I got some shows to shoot the next few days. So it's gonna be a little busier, a little more hectic. Obviously, gonna keep blogging because it's the only way you can be.